Hey everybody, welcome back to the VMP Performance Channel. I'm Justin, and in front of me, I have our new Odin Supercharger Kit. This is our answer to supercharging the 18 plus direct injected Gen 3 Coyote engine. We partnered with Magnuson Superchargers to develop an all new head unit. This is a completely different style than anything we've done before. It's a front inlet, blow up design. We've also refined the entire supercharger kit itself. So I am super excited to tell you about it and show you all the parts in the kit. The head unit is based on the Eaton 2650 rotors, but it's like nothing we've ever done before. The Gen 3 Coyote has some very unique design challenges, mainly being that the valley is full of the additional eight injectors for the direct injection system. So there's no room to put the intercooler in the valley any longer. Our answer to that was to put the intercoolers on top. There are two entirely separate intercooler bricks in each side of Odin. You can see the water inlets and outlets. This is a true dual water pass design for the intercooler bricks, which allows for good distribution of water and to keep temperatures even from front to back as the air comes up out of the center discharge point, goes over to the intercoolers and goes straight into the cylinder heads of the Coyote engine. Odin is an all new design based on the Eaton 2650 rotors. Like I said earlier, we partnered with Magnuson Superchargers to develop this new head unit for the 18 up Coyotes. We also put the inlet on the front, which allows us to get the maximum amount of airflow into the supercharger. This system fits both Mustang and F-150 base Coyote engines. I'm super excited to bring this product to market and to make it available to everybody. In addition to refining the supercharger head unit design, we were able to go through the entire kit and make some little tweaks and optimizations to just make it easier to install, make it perform better, and give you a greater overall experience when you supercharge your Coyote. So one of the things that we did was redevelop the belt system. It still uses the AC belt, the first shiv, the belt that's closest to the block, but it no longer requires grinding, which is just incredibly awesome. We have a tensioner right here that bolts up to the front cover. It uses an existing location. There's no drilling or tapping required. We have what we call our Odin Fiat bracket right here. This bolts to the front cover. As you can see, we supply billet aluminum idlers, all the hardware necessary to install it. There is a ribbed idler pulley that mounts up on the front cover as well in an existing location, no drilling or tapping required. This new belt system is super, super simple. The belts included. The Odin kit starts out with an 88 millimeter supercharger pulley. There is a spacer that gets installed behind the supercharger pulley. Just don't forget that when you're putting everything together. Overall, this new belt system, I'm super happy with it. We're also going to offer eight and 10 rib versions with overdrive balancer pulleys for those people that really wanna crank it up to a thousand plus rear wheel horsepower but even cars like Stang Modes are making 850 rear wheel horsepower with the delivered six rib bell system, which is just incredibly awesome. We've got a front cover mocked up with some of the brackets and parts that we're gonna show you here. So you can see for yourself how clean and simple it is, no grinding, easy to install, gets you up and running very quick when you install this Odin supercharger system on your car. The next thing that's unique about Odin is it required all new billet fuel rails to account for the blow up design. We put so much intercooler brick directly over the Coyote intake ports on the cylinder heads that uh, we had to stretch the fuel rail in a very, very unique way. So the fuel actually comes in along the length of the rail and then these fingers feed the individual ports. These rails are entirely billet aluminum, like I was saying, and with that comes number eight fittings on either end. So if you do a fuel system in the future, these rails are entirely ready to go. We include a number eight crossover. We include all the fittings and parts to hook it right up to the factory fuel system. And then once you do a fuel system yourself, these rails do not have to be changed. They are entirely ready to go. The Odin kit also includes our dual fan triple pass heat exchanger system. 
That system has been incredibly successful for our GT500 customers, for our older Gen 3R supercharger kits, and it is once again included with the Odin supercharger system. To get the coolant through the heat exchanger, we include a high flow brushless intercooler pump. We of course include the power harness for the intercooler pump and for the dual fans. We include the degas bottle with mounting bracket, lines, fittings, even some hose cutters to trim the hoses as necessary. Everything's included when it comes to the cooling system for the Odin Supercharger kit, and it is an awesome system. I have beat on this system on the street, just repeated pulls um, right up to the speed limit and then slow down and then right back again. And this whole system works incredibly well. It keeps the downstream air temps in the low 100s the whole time, and that is just freaking fantastic. And it's the result of having an extremely well-engineered charge cooling system directly in the lid of the supercharger. We've covered the all-new supercharger design, the cooling system, the belt system. We covered the fuel rails. Now, included with the Odin kit are FIC 1000cc injectors. These are huge. They will supply you with plenty of fuel. We also include one of our VMP plug-and-play fuel pump boosters. This is gonna allow you to use the stock fuel pump without having to make any modifications to the factory fuel system. And when you are ready to upgrade to E85 and do a return style fuel system, you will have a big enough injector installed with your supercharger to support that. One thing to remember about the Gen 3 Di Coyote is a 1000 cc fuel injector it does work with E85 because you've got an additional eight injectors in the valley for the Di system to provide additional fueling on E85. The Odin Supercharger Kit comes with one of our famous VMP Twinjet 69 throttle bodies. These work extremely well. They're very easy to tune. They have great drivability because of the twin blade design. Now, this is what's included standard with the Odin Kit. It's good for eight, 900 rear wheel horsepower easily. We do have the option to upgrade to a VMP Monoblade 163R throttle body. This is recommended for builds over 1,000 rear wheel horsepower. We've had this throttle body support 1,200 rear wheel horsepower, which is just freaking awesome. There is something unique about the throttle body design. The motor is on the left-hand side, so it is different than our previous throttle body designs. Just uh, keep that in mind if you're ever to try to mix and match parts with an Odin supercharger. Maybe you said, oh, I've already got a VMP throttle body. Well, this one is unique for Odin. And connected to the throttle body is an all new air intake system that we co-developed with AFE Performance. And this is a 120 millimeter mass air. We've got a box system right here. The filter system's pretty neat. The filter actually locks into the box. And that is the cold air kit that is included with the 18 up Mustang Odin supercharger kits. We've hit the major components that come with the Odin supercharger system. Everything else that you see here on the table are the little bits and pieces that make it work properly. This is the air intake temperature harness and the threaded brass IET sensor. The IET mounts on the back of the Odin supercharger system and this allows either us, VMP, if we're tuning your car or your tuner to get proper air temperature readings into the ECU for proper tuning. This little baggie right here is the hardware that holds Odin down to the cylinder heads. This is the EVAP adapter harness. This is the hose. One of the uh, unique components that we had to develop for the Odin supercharger system are these new heater tubes that go on the driver's side and passenger side of the Coyote engine. This one right here allows the heater tube to clear the inlet. This one just makes the passenger side heater line routing a little bit cleaner. So these are included with the Odin supercharger system. So the install is just perfect. Everything you see here is what you need to get Odin installed on your Coyote, except for hand tools and labor. VMP also offers custom tuning with the Odin supercharger system. We use the HP Tuner's RTD or this Engage device that I'm holding to deliver the tune. Our team at VMP provides you with a base tune, reviews data logs, and makes sure that it's dialed in perfect to keep your Coyote running safely and making a lot of horsepower. 
I just mentioned horsepower. Well, how much horsepower does the Odin supercharger system make? It starts around 700 rear wheel horsepower with an 88 millimeter pulley, and it can be turned up from there as high as you want. Beyond about eight, 900, 1,000 rear wheel horsepower, you should strongly consider a built motor. You're gonna need a return style fuel system along the way. You're gonna wanna consider our eight and 10 rig upgrades but the basic foundation is built right into the Odin supercharger system. We've got a huge inlet, two intercoolers. The port design in this system is absolutely huge. We're actually going to open up the supercharger and shoot some shots of the inside so you can see the runners that feed the cylinder head. You can see the intercooler bricks in the lid. The bricks in the lid are incredibly thick, three inches and that just gives a chance to cool the air down incredibly for those IETs that are just completely flat during a dyno pull or during a track pass. The results we've had so far from our Odin supercharger system have been nothing short of incredible. From running 950 on a stock engine to making over a thousand rear wheel horsepower on the dyno with a built engine. We can't wait to see what you guys, our customers, do with the Odin Supercharger system when you get it installed on your car. For more content about VMP performance and the new Odin Supercharger system, make sure you like, subscribe, and share. We'll see you next time.